the Pectra hard fork, like every hard fork, has a lot of kind of improvements to the Ethereum protocol as usual. In particular, it has some of the biggest wallet impacting improvements that the Ethereum protocol has ever taken on. By far, the most exciting thing about Pectra for me is EIP 7702. 7702. 7702. 7702, count abstraction. EIP 7702 is going to give existing users a first taste of what smart contract accounts can do in terms of UX unlocks. The basic idea is that now you can have your externally owned accounts also executing code like a smart contract. It's just a very fundamental way of interacting with Ethereum that's going to change. As soon as you can make an account programmable, the first question you should ask is, what do you want to program your account to do? This is a multi-purpose, open-ended sort of tool that we're giving to the community and we're saying go forth and abstract things out. It's going to facilitate a lot of uh, use cases that people have wanted for some time. Schedule payments, push payments. Gas abstraction. Gas sponsorship. Gasless transactions. Batch transactions. Cross-chain abstraction. Services where the user delegates some authority to do something to a service or a bot. We will now be able to apply social recovery to Ethereum accounts. We are going to be able to have both signature signing on the protocol level and also we're going to be able to have fine-grained access control on the accounts. I know that I've got a million things that I want to do but they're just kind of particular to me and and so I think that the most exciting things that we can do for users is allow them to come up with new wallet modules and new kinds of connections that allow them to maybe participate in agreements, subscriptions, markets, trades, auctions, all, all kinds of new games that were just unreadable or kind of annoying to participate in before. All those types of things are coming in through the smart account functionality, which is enabled through the account extraction hard fork improvement that's being included in Pectra. There's so much undiscovered potential there. I'm excited to see what app developers in the community do with it. Delegation is an encoded representation of what you want someone or something else to be able to do on your behalf. You're effectively delegating your account to a smart contract, but you can control how much power you give them. To help realize the goals of delegation, at MetaMask we built something called the MetaMask Delegation Toolkit. It's a set of Solidity smart contracts and interfaces that can be incorporated into any smart contract to let it issue delegations that can be open-ended and even have custom policies defined at runtime. Delegations are an open source, composable and transitive smart contract based framework that is specifically built to solve human coordination challenges at scale. And so what we're doing is fundamentally flipping the paradigm of how users with self-custodial wallets interact with applications. We're on the cusp of having this kind of invisible onboarding. We're gonna allow embedded accounts to have users that are getting into crypto that maybe don't know it at all and don't have to think about it. And so for new developers that are, are kind of, maybe they've put off learning Web3 so far, or maybe they recognize that the user experience wasn't there yet. With Pectra, the user experience has never been better. And so we're opening the gates to an absolutely new generation of, of Web3 apps that are more readable, more invisible, and kind of more supercharged in general. And so it's a big opportunity for whoever manages to apply it to their use case first.